seems you might just be a tad bit doomed, you oafs. <laughs> this is hard enough. Do you have to insult us? Yes, yes, yes. Making you feel bad is all part of the trap. God for that. Wow. Let me just tell you right now, dying hurts. It is not fun. Not not at all. It was very, very painful and a very dramatic experience that I do not want to go through again. So I hope there's not a third one down the line. But anyways, guys, hey, 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 everybody. Welcome. Welcome back to Puppet Review Stuff. And of course, today, we are going to be taking a look at the brand new DuckTales episode, episode 13, Escape from the Impossible. <laughs> this is a big follow-up to the last episode, Let's Get Dangerous, because the family finally finds out that Fowl is after them. And this episode, they are actually preparing to fight back on Fowl. So basically, they're kind of training themselves, you know, just in case, not really just in case, you know, when inevitably Fowl attacks them so uh, they'll be ready so this time around all i know is that scrooge is gonna make this impossible and you know set up traps just like classic ducktales you know i'm kind of happy we're finally having a money bin episode you know we've had a couple but not, not, not many and some of my favorite episodes in the original ducktales actually took place in the money bin so i'm kind of happy that we're finally doing something with the money bin you know because we don't really go there often but yeah that's really great you know i am so happy that we're finally progressing the story with foul you know actually you know thinking about this is probably the first time they're actually aware that there's an enemy after them because you know in season one they didn't know anything about magica season two they didn't know anything about the moon people except for donald while well, donald wasn't there to tell them so this is the first time they're actually going to know that there is a threat after them so this is great this is this is really great and i'm actually really excited to see how they're going to prepare themselves are they going to prepare themselves Themselves? Well, Dewey's probably not going to be prepared because he's Dewey. He's useless. Anyways, guys, I'm excited to watch this, so let's go ahead and start the reaction. Three, two, one, let's go. Foul, the fiendish organization for world larceny is back. Yeah, yeah, we know. Have been eliminated by agents of Shush. They've risen. Well, it's pretty obvious they've risen again. Why don't you tell us something new? Bradford Buzzard. The head of my board of direct. Seriously, an another little recap? Why can't you just give us some new information, huh? We already knew this stuff! Da, 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 oh, 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 okay, calm down, Scrooge. Oh, I'm sorry, I won't, I won't raise my voice again. Yeah, it could be any of you! Look at you, Dewey! S seriously, Donald? I would say like it's more like Dewey. But Seriously, you just had to make a pun? You see, you see why I think it's him? All right, but only because I love the money. I mean you! <laughs> no, 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 you mean the money. Ready for another sneak attack. Mm. But with Webby's help, I will train this family to be I don't, the best... I don't think that, that, that's coming off, buddy. Prepared for any possibility. So what say you? Yeah, of course! I mean, we don't want to die, right? The traitor is probably not Donald. Yeah, probably, probably not. Then then has its own unique traps designed mm. by Duckburg's most dementedly dangerous minds. What, Gyro? Well, of course it is. is it Who else would it be? The dementedly dangerous minds are all friends of ours? <laughs> of course not! Don't think about that! Get outside without being driven huh? to the brink of madness. I'll buy lunch. Really? You think lunch is a suitable reward for not dying? Behold. Behold what, the remote? The, the, oh, wow. Now in test mode. Oh, wow, impressive. You, um, you, you make the building talk. Bradford won't best me again. He probably will, but whatever you say, Scroogey. Um, what are you, um, what are you doing with, with, with that sword, Dewey? Fight, huh? well, yeah, but can you even it. use that thing? It looks like you, you can't even pick it up. How pathetic. I don't want to terrify the enemy this early in the game. Strategy. Oh, you are such a waste of space, aren't you? There has to be something in here about Fowl or Bradford. Well, if it wasn't in there before, then it's probably not in there. When was the last time a book solved a problem? Hey, that, that book has solved a lot of problems. To everything. 
Exactly. And we are ready for anything. Well, you weren't ready for that moon invasion, so I really wouldn't say that. Oh, oh I bet you weren't ready for that as well. Look at that, she's got spoons. Oh, you weren't ready for that spoon, were you? And what do you think running's gonna do? Yeah, yeah, running doesn't do anything. At any time? Any place? But how can we prepare for that? We talk about villains attack you randomly all the time. This shouldn't be new. Oh, what do we got? A minotaur? Lava? Snakes made of spiders. Well, it's definitely gonna be dealing with horrors, so well, let's see what this hallway's about. Oh, look at that chainsaw! Ha! Yeah, that's definitely horrors there. I should do this. Huh? What are you doing? Oh, so what? You, you made the room purple? That doesn't really do anything. And why can I still hear them? Wait, you can't see the saws? Yeah! Wow, that's actually pretty impressive, Scrooge. Special violet colored light that makes everything purple completely invisible. Well, that, that, that's actually pretty obvious, Scrooge. You didn't really like to say that. Ah! Seriously, Dewey, are you seriously still lugging that thing around? Sword isn't gonna save us. Exactly. Logic is. Okay, that probably won't save you as well. I mean, you at least need to know how to fight. <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, that sword is so useful, isn't it, Dewey? Uh, okay, that, that's clearly a trap. You don't tell me you're gonna fall for it, and they fell for it. <gasps> oh, look at that. It's not real. <laughs> Who could have guessed? The ancient art of German paper cutting? Haha, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Very clever, Webby. But I'm too smart to fall for any of your little tricks. D d oh, wow. I actually f fell for that. Oh, I guess I'm not as smart as I thought I was. D and she could just pick up that sword of ease. Oh. Wow. H how weak are you, Dewey? Oh, oh, that that's pretty smart. Hopefully we have, um... Uh, a dozen of that. Do you oafs? <laughs> don't, don't laugh at us. We're about to die here. Yes, yes, yes. Making you feel bad is all part of the trap. <laughs> oh man, I love Scrooge. Mm. I can't see the saw blades. So I'm kind of lost here. Oh, well, that's pretty smart. I mean, that's not gonna work for you know for the ceiling saws and the the, the 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 saws on the wall, but that'll work for the floor, I guess. Fowl doesn't stand a chance, right? Oh, well, I guess we're not gonna get lunch, huh? Wait a minute, why'd well, well, they go no no no? I must have got that number wrong. <laughs> but Scrooge, it, it made no 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 again. What, what, what's going on? Password incorrect. You are now locked out of the system. We're what now? Are, 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 are you shitting me? It just means that I, I no longer have the ability to turn the security system no, off. No, 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 you, you call that nothing? Indications are blocked until the system is shut down. So we're trapped in here? If we want to get out of my bed alive. Then we have to. We have to. Okay, no big deal. What do you mean no big deal? This is a big deal. You did, but it's not a time to be gloating. Stupid gyro, stupid bolt tech. Yeah, oh, you gotta be He actually used bolt tech? Seriously, hasn't he not learned that that stuff is terrible? Of course he did. What would you expect? It's gyro. Yeah, insult it. Yeah, yeah, you, you look stupid. Yeah, and you're stupid. Yeah, there, there we go. Uh, Mrs. B, a word? While I really appreciate... Oh, wow, wait a minute. I, I just realized we're in the other bin. Wow. We haven't been here since, um, since, um, season one. Right. Exercise. We need to be prepared. But I am prepared. No, you're not. You almost got spooned. You're clearly not prepared. This is a secret chamber underneath the house that I never knew about until... <laughs> and you didn't know? Wow. What a loser. No Old Huey's great at rolling with the punches. No, you're not. Jesus, why are you yelling? She can't find us if we're not us. Are you shitting me? God damn it. You are probably the stupidest person in this show. No, this is scary, but I also know I've never met anyone smarter than you. I could probably name a bunch of people that are smarter in this show. Hey, Huey. No. Hey, me. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Is, is, is that him? That, uh, uh, what? That was Webby? Wow. That's a pretty good impression. You were so stupid that it was pretty believable. Of impersonation. Yeah. Wow. It's really good. I would give you an applause if I could clap. Stop acting like a baby. It's over. Mm. She kept her plans a secret, even from me. Are you sure that's a good idea? And we should be prepared. So, um, is something supposed to happen? Because nothing, nothing's actually happening at all. I mean, that's pretty much a good thing. And oh, oh, wait, something happens. Hmm, it seems like it deals with gravity. Actually, that that's pretty apparent. It, of course it deals with gravity. Ancient Rosa runes. Hmm. It's field of gravity. Yeah, obviously. Oh, like foul deal with this. I mean, they can just dodge them. That's pretty simple. I may need a wee bit of help. Wee bit of help, huh? <laughs> yeah, you certainly do. Oh, you got a, you got a plan, Louie? 
Okay, sending out books. I don't know what books have to do with anything, but hopefully that, that does something. Okay, I, I still don't see what you're doing. Ah. Oh, okay, that's, um, that's interesting. I guess that could work. Huh. Ah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, okay, I don't understand how that happened, but, but, but okay, apparently that worked. Oh, lousy and effective death trap. You wanted that to work? Just attack us already! This is no way to live! Jesus, stop being like little bitches! It's fine! This must all be a lesson on how we can't live in fear! No, no, that's not the lesson. The lesson is not to die from foul. Makes it so clever. No. She fooled us. No, that, that, I don't think this was a fool. Oh, look, there's Webby. Oh, here comes the attack! Yeah, you still better start running. Again with the sword, put that sword away. Wow, already captured you. Yeah, you're gonna probably be the first one to die to foul. No, no, no! How can I be ready when I can't trust what I know? You talk about villains attack you all the time! This isn't new! Well done, Webby. Hmm? You've cornered your target. Yeah! As for the boys, they've proven themselves unprepared. Now incapacitated. Yeah, kill him! Hey, don't throw that away. This doesn't feel right. Look at what this training is doing to you. Yeah, but it's good for them. Like, Foul could attack at any moment. Foul is coming. We could lose everything. But we're family. So what you need to teach them how to fight? Defend yourself. No. Uh, no. Can, can we e even say no to Mrs. B? All right, then. If you want to train oh. this way, let's... Be honest, I kind of want to see this fight. Webby versus Mrs. B. <laughs> this should be entertaining. Bad news is, we've almost defeated all my traps. How's that bad news? That, that, that's a good thing! Final <laughs> Seriously, one trap. more it thing? All the best defenses we've seen thus far, combined with the fighting techniques of the greatest <laughs> warrior of the past century. You, you mean Darkwing Duck? I am the terror that flaps in the night. I am the scourge that packs at your nightmare. I am Darkwing Oh, no, it's just... It's just a robot of you. Wait, you think you're the best fighter in the world? I, mean, I thought it would look a bit more impressive considering what I paid. Yeah, me too. What? Oh, oh, shit, that thing is shaking. Oh, 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 shit, it's a transformer. What? Oh, wow, there's claws and it's making light bulbs. Oh, oh, wow, that, that surely is impressive. Look at it, it got a screen as well. Changed my mind, that thing is pretty impressive. <laughs> we should run. You can't think of anyone else you could have used. Maybe yeah, like Darkwing. A professional adventurer who's never lost a fight? Yeah, like Darkwing. Donald? But then no, we're not Donald! <laughs> so, uh, are you kidding me that they could turn invisible? That's kind of cheating. Mm. Louis, look out! Oh no, wait, how did you see that? He's invisible. <gasps> oh my god, he, he's doing it! He's doing it! Oh my god! Ah. That thing has gravity powers as well? Wow, that, that's one impressive robot. Okay, yeah, pull on its hat. Maybe, well, I don't think hitting it's gonna do anything. Seriously, that reflected back at it? Oh, wow, that was easy to take down. If we can beat it, so can Bradford. I mean, yeah, but that means you can build a better robot. Bradford knows everything about me, my business, my weaknesses. Oh, come on, he doesn't know everything. Go! <gasps> it's it's foul vulture. Associate Agent D has hacked into your system. You can me? Could you have just given us a day or at least a season's worth before attacking? What do you want, you sourpuss scavenger? If I told you that, I wouldn't be a very effective shadowy nemesis. Oh come on, you! Why don't you just tell us your evil plan like every villain? Consider this my two weeks' notice. Now you were already fired. <laughs> oh, wow, it's an impressive fight. I mean, yeah, actually, not not really, because I didn't really see any of it. No, it seems like you can't see for us to come now. So you're ready for foul, Webby. No, what the hell? How did you guys get up there? I've never seen her push me like this before. Something's wrong. Of course, something's wrong. Foul's gonna attack. I mean, actually, they're already attacking. Oh shit, we're taking this to the roof. Okay, what what do you two think you're gonna do? Oh yeah, nothing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you can do anything, Webby. Maybe you should um go to the other side. You know, she, she looks pretty mad. You shouldn't have said no. She's my granddaughter. I'll determine what's best for her. Yeah, beating her up. That That's the best thing for her, isn't it? Oh, oh, oh there she goes. Oh, no. Hmm. Aw, family. Oh, 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 family. Now we're going to stop fighting, right? The one thing we know for sure is that we trust each other. That, that, that's not going to help. You need to learn how to fight. Oh, we're hugs. I guess we're gonna forget about this. You know, we do need to learn how to fight, but, but well, what's that? Alert! We hmm? need to get to the bin. Now. Are you now getting an alert for the money bin? Yeah. 
Oh, oh god. This would be much more efficient if you simply give up now. Why would we do that? Scrooge, you're yeah, you're Scrooge McDuck. No, do do. don't say that. You're Scrooge McDuck. You could do anything. You're basically Jesus. Oh yeah, of course. This is made by Boltec, so of course it doesn't work. Oh, I see what we're doing. We're gonna lift the money up so we can destroy that machine, and, and, and Scrooge can swim through the money. You know, and that's pretty smart because Scrooge is the only one that can apparently swim through money. And also Louie. Can't forget about Louie. Yeah, there we go. All come into plan. Boom. Yeah, you're dead. Yay, money bin. <laughs> yeah, we should probably, like, destroy that, you know, completely so, you know, they get spy on us. Beat all these traps is because we're basically amazing. Yeah, you guys are basically the Jesus family. You can do anything. You know what? You're right. If we stick together, there's nothing we can have a situation. Of course. <laughs> what do you mean situation? You, you already kind of missed it. Anything important? Screws you but double Wait, Goldie? Did you take huh? the fountain of youth? The, the, fount the, the, the fountain's gone? Well, when I went back to steal it again myself, it was gone. The Faust stole the fount. Hey, hey, and the harp of Mulana? M M Mervana? Oh, whatever it's called. And our positive vibes did like nothing. Of course it didn't. <gasps> the Dark Dark Wing! <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh. And the genie! The genie! Someone the is stealing me! Uh. Oh, wow. Val was busy. We are done playing defensively. Yeah, we're gonna kill them all. Exactly! Okay, en enough with the sword. You're ruining the moment. I guess it's a little fixed with that. Hmm. Yeah, we're gonna kill Fal. Anyways, guys, that was the brand new episode of DuckTales. That was amazing. I love that episode. Sure, it's not as good as Let's Get Dangerous, but it was a great follow-up to that episode. This was fantastic. For one thing, it took place in the Money Bin, which is one of my favorite locations in DuckTales history, so it's just great to finally go back there. And I don't know if we actually went there all season. I think we just, you know, went there maybe one time, but I don't recall a time that we were really there this time. But that's great. That was really great. And also, I'm just loving the fact that we're finally progressing the story with Fowl. This is fantastic. You know, them, you know, trying to prepare for Fowl. This was great. And also, that little ending where Fowl was actually stealing all that stuff. They got the Harp of Muvana. They also got that thing in Darkwing. I, I, I can't believe it. We got Darkwing again two episodes in a row. I was kind of surprised to see Darkwing again, but great. Great, great little cameo. And of course, the Fountain of Youth is stolen as well. Wow, Val has been busy. Val is really ramping up their attack. God, and the genie. Wow, you know what? This actually was a question I thought of this week. What happened to the genie? What did they do with the genie after they found it? The, 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 apparently, they just left it there. I would have thought they would just take it with them. I mean, it's a goddamn genie lamp. I mean, why wouldn't you take it with you? But, yeah, that that's interesting. The genie's still around. Seems like Phantom Block has had a hold of it, and he's fixed his little gauntlet. And I wasn't even expecting there to be an actual foul attack in this episode, just because I'm just pretty much assuming that this takes place the day after Let's Get Dangerous, so I, I just wouldn't assume they would attack right away, but surely enough, they did, and they hacked into Scrooge's server, just really showing that they actually are a threat, and something that, not just one of these, like, joking villains like Glomgold or, you know, Mark Beast, which is probably one of the worst villains in DuckTales, but, you know, they're showing that they actually are a threat and they are trying to kill them. Sure, they've had villains like Magica. She is a threat. Yeah, but she's kind of turned to a joke. Most of their, like, main villain threats are kind of a joke. And Fowl, Fowl is actually a threat. And I like that they're really showing that. And also, as I said before, I really love the fact that they are actually aware that there is a threat. I never expected them to find out this quickly, to be honest. I thought they were going to find out, like... Probably almost like by the end of the season, like with Magica and the Moon People, but no, they actually know that they're here. So this second half of the season is going to be very, very interesting, and I'm really excited to see what happens next, because I've, I've read the description for the next episodes, and... I am pretty much looking forward to these a lot, and I know Lena's coming back next episode, and thank God, I've seen a picture of her, thank God, she's not her blue little, m m friendship is magic little form, thank God, I, I, I mean, I don't hate it, but it's just like, I don't want her to look like that forever, those eyes, I really think it's the eyes that I really do not like about that, that look, but yeah, Lena's coming back, you know, there's also a Christmas special with Santa Claus, and I'm excited for that one, um, there's also one where they go back to Castle McDuck, so... 
that's exciting. Also, there's an episode where they deal with, like, the gods again. I'm not really looking forward to that one, just because I never like the episodes that deal with, like, Hercules or Zeus. Those are never my favorite episodes, so I'm not really looking forward to that, but I am looking forward to these episodes. The Tales is getting exciting. Now, anyways, guys, I guess that's really it for me. There's nothing else to really talk about, so thank you all for watching. Please like, subscribe, and of course, I'm gonna see you all next time, so goodbye, everybody. Goodbye.